Hi guys and welcome to My Sims 4 Let's Play. <laughs> Never really done one of these before, so I'm going to try. Um, I know, let's go through this one. Okay, in the household. Show me quiz up. See if I've got any wow. saved households. In my gallery. My oh, library. Okay, so this is uh, something I've made before. And it's got no story to it at all, so I'm just going to play from the beginning. Just let me show you a bit more of him. Should I say them? And I'm just going to bring Household into the Create Sim. Here we go, we've got Hank, obviously he's the father, we've got Holly, um, we've got Alicia, and we've got Colby, oh, no, I just clicked on him by accident, so um, let's go ahead and create our house. Wait for it to load when it decides to load. Okay, let's go into build mode because we don't want them to play while I'm building. Hmm. So, what do we need? We need a kitchen. And I can't be bothered to actually build myself a kitchen, so I'm going to go for one that I like. I think I prefer it in the red. So, let's buy the room. And I'm going to place it around here hmm and that's okay yep I need a hallway because otherwise they're gonna be walking into like nothing create a room um how big do I want my house I'm gonna need if we have that I can have my stairs somewhere there's that. Right now, do I want a hallway so it takes it? Let's take it so it takes it into another room. Oh, let's move. What else do I need? Do we need a bathroom? Yes, I recommend a bathroom downstairs. I'm only going to go with a small one. I think um, we'll go with that one. It's kind of average small. Wait, where's the door? I need to know where the door is. Door is by the. I'll put it there. That's right, because there's the door. So if we extend this room hallway, that's that is the bathroom. Probably should have put the dining room somewhere before I did anything else but hey ho this is a beginning thing so we go for a modern more modern look we'll go for the red seeing that my kitchen's a bit red um, I'm just gonna put that there so they can walk straight into the 
dining room and now we just need a living room so let's go for a modernized living room again all probably helps if I get some money and I'm a cheater so I'm going to add some money and I will add this cheat into the description so that you can use it yourself if you're a cheater like me if not then work for money but I don't because I'm boring and I like to be rich and I'll probably do it up until about a million so I know that I won't run out of money and then I can just get my sims to start working so my money adds up again so I can build myself a decent house so there we go and um, we'll just do that again I'm going to buy my now now buy myself my living room I'm just gonna make sure that everything's okay there should probably rotate it because it looks a bit stupid like that so I'm gonna rotate it and I'm gonna rotate again and I'm gonna move it just so it's in a right way round I will buy some windows eventually <coughs> because my house looks a bit odd at the moment right that is the downstairs of my house and I think that's pretty basic as a starter so I'm just going to probably buy some stairs you know that kind of does help when you're building a house um, I'll put do I want the stairs there or do I want them here probably have them, I'm just going to place them out here so I can turn them around I'm going to place them there so they don't look odd when I go up the stairs and I need a front door because otherwise they're not going to be able to get in um, we'll go with that one because that looks quite cool do I want it in a different colour though? I might go with the red because I like red well, now do I want it in an ordinary place or do I want it in the middle we'll go for the middle and what we're going to do is I'm going to buy an, I'm going to buy an arch so that I don't have to go for another door and I need a back door so I'm going to buy a back door so that they can get out the back which you know is sensible let me just view the house oh it probably helps if I actually um decorate the outside of it so I'm just going to go for a, a masonry I think that's how you say it anyway I think I'll go with some sliding actually I'm going to go with some sliding um and what colour do I like I want something that's not going to clash with my door red will clash so if I go for just a basic basic colour so I'm just going to go for the basic colour and I'm going to cut because I cannot be bothered to do the whole of the room I'm going to now try to move but because I can't I'm going to look retarded by going there we go I think that's the whole of the outside I now need to find some sort of drawer right now I don't want a drywall um, I know a nice basic pink I'm sure Hank will appreciate that when he walks through the house. House, shall I say, not horse. And I'm going to need a carpet. Should we go for a nice carpet? A nice plush carpet. There you go, something like that. That's quite nice. Okay, I'm going to add some... Actually, do you know what? I'm going to go for the nice pink, pink walls that I uh, put in the downstairs was oh I need some lights because my uh, my room's a bit dark what do we go for I want something that's stylish oh I quite like them so I'm gonna go for them I'm gonna put two just here and I'm gonna put oh, one there 
and one there. And if Kevin speaks one more time, I'm going to slit his throat. Right, let's go up a level. I should probably add some walls. But first, I'm going to find a room. So we want a bedroom for obviously the uh, couple. So, no, I don't like it in the green. I quite like the red, but I'm going to go for that colour because it stands out. So that's that one done. I think I've just added it with the win the door out the other way round. But that's fine. Although I probably could put it there so they've got a nice window view. And then the door can lead out somewhere else. Yep, we like that. And I'm now going to get a nursery. Because obviously I will probably bound to have a baby soon. Well, I specifically won't, but I'm sure they will. <laughs> Let's put that there, so that leads into the nursery. I think I might put that back a bit more. And I don't want the house looking boring, so I'm going to move that over, and I'm going to put them there, so that that bit creates a gap there because I. I think it'll look nicer. I now need to either go up a level or I need to put my teenager's room in. Which is we go for... I think we'll just stick with that one. We'll stick her somewhere. We'll stick her there. My house looks going to look really odd, but who cares? So we've stuck her there, and I now need boys' bedroom, and that's probably going to look weird as well. So we're now going to have to put that somewhere, and I can't find a place to put it. So I'm now going to have to extend my house somehow, but I'm not too sure how. Mm. Or I could just go up another level. I think I will go back and I'm going to put a toilet somewhere. We just get a nice toilet see, something like that. Mm. Uh, we want a modern one because my family is quite modern. Um, or do we go for that one? No, because we want a bath. Well, I could add the bath in. Now, do I want it in the red or green? And Kevin wants it in the red, so we're going to put it in the red. Um, and I'm going to put it there. Or do I put it there? No, I'll put it at the back. Because it looks probably nicer. And then I'm just going to go and get the balls. And... Yaddy yaddy yaddy. And that's pretty much that. Right, that's that's done. I need to quickly make sure all the doors are on the inside of the house and not the outside. Like that one. So let's make sure that we get rid of that door. And make sure the parents can actually get into their room. So let's get a door. Now my, I'm thinking a double door. So it looks like the master bedroom. See now that's nice. Um, and I might put a door there. Just so that if the parents are out the kids do not have to go through the, uh, well the teenagers shall I say, don't have to go through the parents room get to the baby and I'm just gonna go with the basic door and I'm gonna delete the other object just need to get some lights and then my upstairs will be finished 
well my second floor will be finished and then um oh probably actually helps if i decorate the upstairs as well and not just leave the walls all plain and probably put some windows on the house you know because um do need some natural light um we'll just go with the same color as this so it doesn't clash with anything and I'm saying the word clash quite a lot today. If we go downstairs a level, just so I can get that lovely pink that Hank is going to love. And obviously the carpet colour. So if I just get the carpet colour and go up. There we go, there's the lovely pink. And if I just get some windows 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 and put two on the front and I get one there and one there and I'm gonna put one in their room you know one in the baby's room I think that was the living room we'll just put one there one there one there do we want one in the bathroom? No, I think we can leave the bathroom one because obviously we want the privacy. And the back, well, we can just leave the same. I think we can put one window in the uh, hallway just to give it some natural light. And I need to buy some stairs just so I can go up again. Uh, we'll go for the same stairs. And I'm going to place them here just so I can turn them and I'm going to carry them and I need to go down a level so down I need to get rid of those so I can see <clears throat> if we do that we go up a level there we go and I'm just going to put a bathroom up here I want styled rooms because like I said I cannot be bothered to do I want a kids room and I'm gonna go for that and I'm gonna go for that for that one again and I'm gonna stick that there right let's go make sure my doors are in the right way around because we don't want them being in the wrong way around do we now I think they're gonna be able to fit through that gap I'd say so so I'm now Kevin's going to be quiet. Let's just fill in the odd gaps. And my house is nearly done. Which obviously took me quite a while because I'm quite new to this still. Um, I hope they're going to fit through that gap because otherwise it's going to be a bit weird. Oh damn. Um, I now need to go back. Oh dear, what have I done? There we go. I need to get my uh, wall colour again. So I need to go down the stairs. I need to get that lovely pink colour. I need to apply it. I need to go back downstairs. I need to get my carpet colour. And I'm going to go up a level. Now I need to go back downstairs. And I need to get my lamps. So I'm going to put one there, one there. Oh, and I can't put one there. But I'll put one there. So that's that. And I'm going to get my windows. One. Oh. Poo 
bum. I'm gonna get one there. I'm gonna put one there. Oh, I can't put one there. So I'll leave that one. And I'm gonna leave the bathroom one. Um oh, gonna leave that one, aren't we? Right, so that is pretty much my house done. Probably helps if I add a roof and obviously the outside. So that's that done. Just add my roof. Um, I'm going to go for that. And I don't want a big roof, so I'm going to go down so it's a flat roof. And I'm just going to add the roof again. I'm just going to go down. And there we have it, it's my house. So I think we're pretty much done there. Do I add a wall or do I add a gate? Um, I don't know, actually know how to add a gate. Just yet. Is that it? No. Um, okay. Gates. Oh, right. I need to add a wall. I got ya. Yeah. Yeah, that didn't really help that much. I should probably have... ...moved... ...that. Oh, now I need to add my gate. And I want a posh gate, so I'm going to find a posh gate. I like that one. add my actual gate and um, I can't actually remember what it looked like but I'm gonna go with nothing like that oh so I don't think I can actually add a gate because my house is too close so we're gonna have to get rid of that and I'm gonna have to delete it oh go back <laughs> go back <laughs> go back <laughs> okay, like I said, I'm relatively new to this. Um, I don't think I'm going to actually add anything to my house, but I'm now going to sort the garden out because I don't actually have a garden. And I should probably get a garden. See, something like that I do. Um, I'm just going to place that there because that seems pretty much legit. And there we go. There we have it. Um, I now need to quickly go into the rooms so that there's some toys in the garden because otherwise, you know, he's going to probably be a bit bored, the boy. Outdoor activities. Um, I'm going to go with this. So I think that looks pretty cool. And I'm going to go for the monkey bars. And why not, you know, Holly might want to do some gardening. So if we just do the, the patches there. And I think, guys, that is my house complete. I should probably add a fence around the play area, but I'm sure my child is old enough to realise that he cannot wander anywhere without asking his parents. I'm just going to move that, see if it's there. And there we have it, there is my house. Let's play. Oh, 
Okay, so down here is this is where all the needs are. And obviously Sims, if you play The Sims like me and are a Sims addict, which I am, you will know that the new Sims have emotions that you have to control. So at the moment Holly is reading Orbital Pudding. Sounds cool. And Alicia is now asleep. But she is in the wrong bed, so we're going to kick her out of the bed and we're going to take her to her room. And I'm going to speed it up a bit because so she gets in bed quicker. So up here, as you can see, this is the notification wall. And this is where all your notifications are. So as you can see, three days ago I had a game and one of my Sims were family oriented. And Kevin, yeah, that's my boyfriend, so yes, I do play real life things. But after a while, this notification wall gets filled up, so you actually have to delete them all, which is what I'm going to do now. And you just click yes, and you can hide it as well. So I don't tend to have that up a lot of the time. And that's this is the Sims inventory. This is where you have like the Sims homework and what they have in their inventory, so they can play with. So now Colby is tired so we've got to send him up to his bed if he can get in there. <laughs> and so is Holly. So I'm just going to send them all to sleep and the time will speed up and speed through the game for you until one of the sims wake up. And I need a drink. And um, yeah, Colby is still awake. Wakey wakey. And down here you'll see the time speed up. See? Until someone wakes up. Which hopefully isn't soon. And we're just going to wake Colby up because he's going to have school soon and he's hungry. So we need to make sure that he wakes up eating and goes to school happy. And Alicia needs a toilet so she's going to go to the toilet and she's going to go and get some food. So I'm just going to click on these. This is the easier way to go and get them food. So if you just click on this little round thing then it will send them straight to where you want them to go basically. And you need to wake up because you're going to uh, die of hunger otherwise. And you have to make sure that you take care of your sims because if they get too starving or if they wee themselves there is a cause that they may die of um, humiliation or starvation. So you need to make sure that you look after your sims. Just think of them as you really but just on a computer. Var Pasa. Basic Musma Florib. Jillibar Kitsuni. Kiniku Swarsbarinka. Bruhana Deloba. Ah, Ina. What proba choosing? A snorps. Glufa warmba. Let's turn Zerpa nooch. 
Trivine new play. <laughs> Trivna. <laughs> and now she's embarrassed. Right guys, I'm going to leave it at that pretty much because uh, this video is going to take ages to upload onto YouTube otherwise. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it here and yeah. before <laughs> the kids go to school I will leave it there so we can come back to it when the kids go to school and then we're going to go out and find some jobs. So thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and please comment, like and subscribe and comment what more you want to see if you want to see more children if you want to see um whatever you want to see really just comment and i'm sure i can help you out thanks guys bye